Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? In this video, we'll show you how to replace the roller bearing cage in a GE dishwasher. It's going to be a very easy repair, it should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a small flat blade screwdriver and a large flat blade screwdriver. When we open up the package, you're going to get a new roller bearing cage. The rolling bearing cage is located between the inner and outer upper dish rack slides and allows for a smooth movement of the dish rack when it's fully extended. The main reasons why a roller bearing cage would need to be replaced is if it breaks and the bolt bearings become loose, causing the dish rack to jam. Let's start with opening the door. Pull out the upper dish rack. Using the small flat blade screwdriver, Open the locking tab on the side of the dish rack stop and take the stop off. Repeat the procedure on the opposite side. After we remove the stops, we can slide the upper dish rack off the rails. Push the inner slide in. Using the large flat blade screwdriver, push open the locking tab and then take off the rear dish rack stop. Pull out the inner slide. Grab the edge of the bearing cage and remove it from the outer slide. If you wish to replace both rolling bearing cages, use the same part number. This is the old roller bearing cage next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. Before installing the new rolling bearing cage, we need to bend it to shape. Bend the sides 90 degrees so the little protrusions are inside the cage. Clip in the cage inside the outer slide, right in the middle of it. Place the inner slide in and install the rear dish rack stop. Pull out the slides, slide the dish rack rollers into the rails. Install both dish rack stops. Push the upper dish rack in and close the door. Looks like we're done with the repair, no more dirty dishes. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other repair videos available on our site, on Facebook, and on YouTube.